just follow me with the actions and I'll sing this song. The river it is flowing and flowing and flowing. The river it is flowing down to the sea. So here we've gone travelling into the wide, wide world, to the great and wonderful land of China. And in China, there are dragons. Do you like dragons? I love dragons. And do you know the question I get asked more than any other? Are dragons? real. And do you know what I have to say? Yes, of course. There are dragons everywhere. Only sometimes we don't even see them. First of all, I'm going to need a piece of paper. <coughs> now paper is wonderful stuff. Paper can become anything, anything at all. So I'm going to take my piece of paper and I'm going to fold it in half and make it into a semicircle. Or is it the moon? Or is it a fan? So here are my scissors. Here is my paper. And here is my story of Lao Lao, of Dragon Mountain. Long, long ago in the country of China there lived an old woman and her name was Lao Lao. Now Lao Lao lived in a tiny village high up in the foothills of Lungshan, Dragon Mountain, where the ice dragon reigned. And she lived a very happy life growing vegetables in her garden but then at the end of the day she'd come and sit on the little seat outside her house and there she would take the scissors that she kept in her front pocket and a small piece of paper and then all of the children of the village would come and gather round and watch just like you're watching me now and then Lao Lao would fold and cut the paper and as she cut the paper she'd say this little rhyme fold it and cut it and turn it around, open it up, and see what you found. And all the children would watch in amazement as Lao Lao folded and cut the paper. What's it going to be? Was it, um, was it a fish? Um, a fan? Uh, a bird? Hmm. And this is Lao Lao's little rhyme in Mandarin Chinese. Well, it goes something like this. Can you can? Shen Mo Shui Xiang Xiang. 